Welcome back to my writer's room, everyone. I'm Matt Wallace, and thank you for taking a few minutes out of your day to come hang out with me here in my lonely little writerly sanctum. I always appreciate it. Uh, me not being naked on the vlog is brought to you by our t-shirt of the day, which is my Hulk smash t-shirt. One of my wife's personal favorites, my wife Nikki. Um, I think because that's kind of how she sees me as her like Bruce Banner, Bruce Banner Hulk hybrid. I'm like Bruce Banner if he didn't like go full Hulk. Like when he got mad, he just like chunked out really puffy and got perpetually annoyed with everything. That's basically where I fall on the Hulk uh, Bruce Banner spectrum. Anyway, so it is um, November 22nd, 2017. You can see Hamshackle Pig is home because there's a little welcome mat. He's arrived back uh, because we are back home. I'm back in my writer's room as promised. Nikki and I have returned from our extended uh, weekend wedding trip of shenanigans. And uh, hey, like I said yesterday when I, I did the On the Road vlog, it, was, it went fantastically. <clears throat> We're glad to be back though. This is going to be a very uh, kind of short vlog today because I've done a lot to do. I kind of just fucked off and unplugged and just didn't pay attention to anything since last Thursday. So coming home, emails are backed up. Uh, physical mail was backed up. Oh, I have to show you this real quick. So this is so this is what we came home to. I had all of these, all of these waiting for me uh, when we came home. And I'm going to be, so I'm going to be spending the rest of the afternoon shooting unboxing videos for my uh my wrestling channel matt f and wallace um and nikki's nikki is actually going to join me for some of them so that's going to be a lot of fun we also have uh makeup and uh, beauty product unboxings that we're going to be doing on this channel just for fun because nikki loves makeup and beauty products i'm actually wearing foundation right now i don't know if you can tell or not i'm not going to go into why but that's just the thing we're going to be doing um, so yeah, I came back. I got uh, what have I got going on? I got I received my my editor, uh, my Cinejour editor, um, uh, Lee Harris from Tor.com Publishing. Uh, he sent me uh, copy edits for the final Cinejour book, Taste of Wrath, um, from my fantastic uh, copy editor Richard Shealy. Um, so I have those to finish, and that's very emotional. I talked about it on the vlog before, being finished with the final Cinejour book, which comes out. Um, April or May of next year. I suddenly can't remember, but it comes out next year. And uh, I also got an email from Murr, uh, Murr Lafferty, my Ditch Diggers co-host, because we've got a, we're planning our 50th episode of Ditch Diggers, the Ditch Diggers podcast, and we're planning our final episode of the year. And we're talking about a other bunch of business-related matters for the channel, not the channel, the podcast. Um, I got, <laughs> I'm doing so much. Uh, what else happened? I got... Um, uh, Helljack, my webmaster and my all-around cyber digital ninja type guy, he sent me um, like the proof, the test email of my new newsletter, my new author uh, writing newsletter, which is going to be called Matt Wallace's Fighting Words. So pretty soon, hopefully, we'll be able to announce that. You'll be able to sign up for that and get original flash fiction from me and announcements, and there's going to be contest giveaways and all kinds of cool stuff I'm doing with that. So, um, yeah, and of course, I still got a novel to finish by the first of the year. So there's that. And, uh, yeah, so it's just, it's, it's pretty stacked right now. Tomorrow, this is the day before uh, thank, the holiday known as Thanksgiving. And uh, I'm gonna, I'll, I'll talk about Thanksgiving tomorrow when I do tomorrow's vlog. But here's the thing I, here's the thing I wanted to say today. Uh, whether Thanksgiving is a thing for you or not, whether you celebrate it or not, it is a major American holiday observed by many people and it, it always affects uh, everything no matter how you feel about it so it, it's a holiday and holidays are they're difficult they're very hard for, for people especially this year I feel like as hard as holiday as hard as everything is usually writing and deadlines and making stuff and being a freelance creator and being a freelance creator during the holidays when freelance work shuts down and just surviving during the holidays. Everything is compounded this year because of how shitty everything kind of is right now. I feel like I'm tilting gradually to this side. My tripod actually broke five minutes before I sat down to record this. It's being held together by scotch tape right now. So I apologize if I'm a little off kilter. But um, holidays are very hard for people. They're particularly hard for people this year. I am one of many expats who uh, lives in Los Angeles. I moved uh, back to Los Angeles. I was born in Downey, California, so I'm from Southern California. But I moved back to Los Angeles in 2010, 
and joined a huge community of, you know, screenwriters and freelance writers and freelance creators, editors, designers, all these people who come from other places and live here away from the family and friends they grew up with. <clears throat> and um, holidays are particularly hard for her, can be particularly hard for people like that. I know I had years where everybody assumed, and we, we tend to do this, we, don't, we never want to impose emotionally or be exposed emotionally enough to people to like check on them or like ask them how they're doing or like investigate that. And then people always assumed I was hyper busy for the holidays, they never wanted to bother me. But there were a couple of Thanksgivings there where I like, I, you know, my the only family I was I was really talking to at the time was my mother who lived in Tennessee and you know I was out here trying to trying to make a life for myself and couldn't afford to go back and um, you know there there were years where I could have used company for the holidays that's what I'm that's what I'm getting at <clears throat> uh, and it's never too late to reach out to someone if you've ever seen the movie Scrooged you, you heard Bill Murray's monologue at the end that's basically what I'm saying what I'm saying here um, it's like we just got back into town Nikki and me it's the day before Thanksgiving. It didn't stop me from today emailing and uh, texting all of my like LA people who I uh, who I wasn't sure had someone or somewhere to go for the holidays you know so that that's a thing that I really tried to do today you know if, if I knew somebody was by themselves <clears throat> or could be by themselves you know people who aren't married or with or with somebody or, or don't have family around them I reached out to them and I just said hey if you need somewhere to go tomorrow you can always come join Nikki and me for Thanksgiving and grub up and we're happy to do that. So I really encourage you to do that today because it's not too late. The day before Thanksgiving is like the perfect time. You know, if there's, and it's not just LA people and expats and displaced people, people everywhere. There's always somebody around you um, who you may think, oh, they're covered. Doesn't hurt to check. So that's, that's what I encourage you today. I encourage you to reach out to the people around you that you care about. Make sure they have somewhere to go tomorrow if that's a thing that's like going to affect them, you know, and it doesn't, it doesn't hurt to ask. We're also closed off like emotionally and psychologically and physically uh, these days as a culture and as, and as people. It's just absurd. So yeah, reach out to everyone, you know, just very quickly. Text them, email them, give them a call, uh, Snapchat, Facebook, whatever the hell you do. Just make sure they're not alone tomorrow. Make sure they're okay. Um, that's, that's what I encourage you to do. So I will be vlogging tomorrow, the holidays. I really, I do, I really feel like I'm tilting here. Um, I will be vlogging tomorrow during the holiday. There will be a new vlog. And like I said, we've got all these all these things to unbox. So there'll be more content coming to the chat. It absolutely is tilting. I'm gonna have to fix, I have so many videos to shoot today. Um, so I will be back tomorrow with a new vlog, back at you. And, uh, and uh, in the meantime, like I said, reach out uh, to somebody today. I'm Matt Wallace, and I'll see you uh, for the holiday tomorrow, folks.